Hello, today I'll be showing you how to use keyframes in CapCut PC. Keyframes are super easy and useful once you learn how to use them. You can make your videos zoom in and out how you like, move things around the screen, and so much more. Alright, let's get started. So keyframes are basically little points in the video that define the starting and ending point of any smooth transition, or in simple terms, points that you can use to make custom animations with. The most simple keyframe animations will only have two keyframes, but you can add more in between to make the animation even more customized. Okay, in order to add a keyframe, click on the media in the timeline that you would like to add keyframes to. Then at the top right of the screen beneath the video and basic tabs, there will be a position and size drop down menu. Now if you look a little to the right, you'll see a little diamond. This is where we add keyframes. So go to the spot on the timeline where you want to add your first keyframe and then click the little diamond. Now you will see that the diamond will now appear on the timeline. For this tutorial, we are just going to do a simple zoom in keyframe effect. So now add a different keyframe where you want the zoom to end. I'll just put it at the end of the video here. Now we are going to adjust this end keyframe to zoom in a little bit. Now as you can see, when I play my video from the beginning, it will gradually zoom in. If you need to readjust a keyframe, just find the keyframe on the timeline and put your timeline cursor over it. Then you can readjust it however you would like. Well, that's pretty much the basics of keyframes. But one quick tip, if you ever can't find a keyframe point, just click on the video and then next to the diamond at the top right, there should be two arrows. Click on these arrows to go to the next and last keyframes. Alright, thanks for watching and make sure to like and subscribe for more tutorials like this.